start from the beginning. Okay. How to feel like a fat girl. Step one, look in the mirror and know that you are supposed to hate what you see, learn to listen to society, you should die, have you tried to strive to be skinny, double chins are not pretty. Step two, learn to hate yourself. It is easier to starve myself than live with the fact that I am not perfect, that I could never be perfect. Not with rolls instead of bell curves and being fat is a learning curve and the first lesson you are taught is that you are not enough, that they never tell you that weight loss is tough. Step three, laugh when a boy calls you beautiful. Hold your breath. Wait for the punchline. I used to live in the breath. I would let it burn in my chest, my heart would beat louder in my ears, and I would pray hoping that steady thump would drown out the, the inevitable I could not be beautiful, I could not be pretty. My body would never be a canvas on which royalty was painted, I was paper, crumpled and torn, erased and worn, recycled. I would always be recycled because I was not worth keeping, step four. Always wear a shirt with a collar. So when you look down, you can hide the bottom half of your face. No one needs to know of your disgrace. Smile sadly at the thought this was your life, that you'd probably need plastic surgery or a knife. Your double chin would always be a, be a pity. Without it, you, with it, you could not be pretty. Think about it constantly. Ignore the hard material that rubs against the bridge of your nose. You know you have to hide. Step five, never talk size. Rip the tags from your t-shirts, cry over exes like divorced exes, scream at the stretch marks in the mirror, make it clear that you hate yourself. Step six, don't get up on the mornings where you feel big because some days the scale is your only friend. Learn to be defined by your number, your number begin to feel number. Step seven, dread the days you have to eat out in public. Worry about the judgment. Eat salad while your friends eat fast food. Call it a bad mood. Die a little on the inside. Never eat french fries or anything deep fried. Only ever eat half your meal. Tell yourself it isn't that big of a deal. Dressing on the side, no gravy. Always, always go home hungry. Step eight. When a boy calls you pretty, write poetry. Watch the way the words wrap around your skin, the way that combats the sin. Step nine, don't breathe. Step 10, heal scars with band-aids of self-praise. Learn, uh, learn that you are okay, ahead comes better days, know you are worth it. That the scale measures pounds not worth, your body isn't the earth, you don't need to carry the weight of it on your shoulders, you are a soldier, feel beautiful. When a boy calls you beautiful, enjoy it. Believe in the words, hold them close to your curves because you can never be a punchline, because I am no punchline. <laughs>